Um, in this topic, we're going to be doing graphing a vertical or horizontal line. And so two things we need to know is just that a vertical line will always be of the form x equals a number. And a horizontal line will always be of the form y equals a number. Okay. So these are two important facts that you have to know. Otherwise, you will not be able to draw these things. Okay. So these are two very important bits of information. So what that means is if I have x equals 5, that automatically tells me I'm talking about a vertical line where x equals 5. So if I draw my coordinate system, here's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. I should have a vertical line now. I'm on paper, I'm not graphing paper, so excuse me if this is a little crooked, but there should be a vertical line at the x value 5, okay? So that would be the answer there. Similarly, if you're graphing a line um, that's in the form y equals, that is automatically, because it's y equals a number, it's going to be a horizontal line at or where y equals 1. So then again, if I draw my coordinate system here, here's the y value 1. And I'm going to have a horizontal line. Again, I'm just, I apologize if that's not straight. Um, but you're going to have a horizontal line at that y value of 1. OK. And that is pretty much it. As soon as you know these two facts, you should be able to graph those horizontal or vertical lines very quickly.